Hi friends, today we are going to discuss about which Fiori app we can use to display FBL3N. Okay, so we will go and we go to Fiori apps library. Let me go from start. I click on all apps. Okay, and this is the web page you have. Okay, once I get this, okay, and this will come eventually. Okay, FBL3N okay and here you can see fbl3n and here you can see this this is similar to fagll 038 you can use also what's new let's see this one display jgl items this one so we will display gl count line items so whatever what i'm going to do is i'll go to this i'll copy this and oops i'm going oops i'm going here okay and here you can see display I'll go here, display GL, GL account person reporting view. Okay, so if I click on this, I'll get a different, this is reporting view where I'll get all the information related with GLs. So here, if you notice, there's no data coming. No, let's see, it will come at some point because, oops, status, nothing, I think it's, what happened? Oh, doesn't have any information. Probably I don't have the reporting view. Oops. So let me see. Okay. So probably I have I have some authorization issue. So I'll go here, display, and I'll do GL, and I'll go to posting view. Let me see whether this shows up. Okay. This is uh, it's clicking, clicking, and we get posting view. I think it's still showing. And again, uh, Fiori apps can be uh, sometimes uh, it can have some performance issue. Okay, you might be saying, oh, it can never happen, but it can happen based on my experience. It has sometimes, and also you know sometimes the backend may be slow also. Okay. It depends. At the end of the day, it's still talking with the back end. It has all the logic. It has all the user exit that you have to check. And, you know, after that, only it displays. So it's a posting view is showing up. Okay, it's still churning. And, uh, and here, oops, I think it's still going on. It will take some time. But in the meantime, if you want to see some variance and all those things, like some default values, you can see it from here. Settings, you can select default values. Um, and here you can put all these values you can think of. Okay. You, if you see, this is related function, financial accounting. You can put exchange rate type, fiscal year, ledger, fiscal year account, and all those things. So this is pretty handy. And here also you can see on the related with the controlling side you have different okay so if i click on cancel and this is churning forever uh, so let me go and select general ledger and we will say gl and we can see probably we'll see this one that's the normal one okay and here you can see the different types of general ledger we have and here you can see this and we can click on Go, or we can select a different ledger. Let's see. We can select a different ledger. And uh, I didn't put 2020 here. 2020, and I'll click enter. And here you can get all these balances. So it's pretty nice. Here you can see the compare. It's similar to the FAGLL 03H. Okay, so this, this will help you. And here you can export it to CSV. Here you can share. All this information if you want i can select a, a different one and i click go and please choose company code the company code doesn't match so what we can do we can scroll down and we'll see some z's so let's see and i'll click go and we have some data here already okay if you can see and if you want you can put periods you can put gl accounts you name it you can get it Okay, so these are very important information that you can click. And here you can see the different filters uh, that we have selected. Okay, 
Now you can add more five filters. You can see these are the different other filters that we can put. Okay, this is helpful. And here you get all the information. So if I click on this, the debit, I get information. No item selected. Start and enter a screen. What I'll do? Okay, okay. It's, it's showing up. Sorry, I was a little impatient. Here you can see the debit for 1710. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning. And if you like it, share it and subscribe to it. And have a great day.